back to my hometown and uh, that was Agra, basically it's a Kota city. So I saw that uh, uh, at started my practice, I saw there were many patients of acute coronary syndrome who needed uh, um, immediate intervention regarding their uh, coronary status, but they had to be referred to higher centers as uh, many of the intervention centers uh, were not available here and they were not uh, uh, running a 24 7 uh, primary angioplasty program. So I saw there were uh, quite unmet needs and uh, I decided to set up my own intervention cardiology center. Uh, initially when I came to Agra, I used to visit uh, quite a few centers and uh, I saw that uh, at some centers there were uh, really high end fixed labs were there and uh, return on investment was always an issue at those centers. Because at the other end there were some centers who were having a mobile lab and the image quality was uh, big issue over there. The final uh, interventions were not possible there. So when I was planning my center, I had to choose an option where uh, return on investments can be uh, achieved plus without compromising the image quality. My preferences and priorities while choosing the catheter were uh, the foremost thing is the image quality. As an intervention cardiologist, we cannot afford to uh, compromise on our image qualities because that's will uh, result uh, in poorer patient outcomes. The second thing, uh, along with the image quality, we also have to look for the safety of our team and the operator. So, the radiation dose is a very important thing. The third thing is a value added system. The fourth thing is, uh, uh, as I was looking, uh, setting up my setup in uh, Tuta City. So I have to look for the basic infrastructure in terms of space and the electricity supply that will be over here. So it's been around uh, one year since we have been working on this system and the, uh, we have performed various amounts of various cases on this system and the variety of cases have been done here. And I would say the image quality of the system is quite good and the patient outcome has been uh, quite satisfactory. The second thing is that uh, it's a plug and play system. So your running cost is quite low and there are high return of investment. The third thing is the space required to run the system is also quite uh, uh, less. There is uh, no need of a separate battery room. The UPS is quite small and gets fitted in the operating room itself. And so it's a good and handy system to be uh, run in a two tire city. At uh, Rashmi Medical Heart Center, we have done uh, in the last one year we have done a lot of cases and we have done all types of cases in the field of cardiology. Right? Adult cases, pediatric cases. Among the adult cases, we are running a 24 7 PCI program. We are doing uh, for quite a good number of complex angioplasties over there. One total of occlusions have been done here. Then coming out to devices, we are doing uh, all types of uh, pacemakers, single chamber pacemaker, dual chamber pacemaker. Even uh, quite a few ICDs have been implanted over here, and uh, the experience with this system has been quite good. Among the uh, pediatric cases, separate device closures and BMDs have been done over here and uh, even some neuro intervention cases are also being done and the results have been satisfactory and the uh, performance of the system has been quite good.